What's good, y'all? It's your boy Martin, aka The Boxing Purist. Welcome once again to the Truth and Absolute channel, where I speak the truth and nothing but the truth, so help me good God almighty. All right, y'all, so if you're new to the channel, if this is your first time stopping by, make sure to hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, drop a comment down below, let's engage, let's talk boxing. If you've been subscribed, much love and thank you for the continued support. Slowly but surely, the channel is growing and I appreciate you guys. All right, y'all, so, I was thinking, I was thinking, you hear the name or the term weight bully being turned around quite a bit, quite a bit. And to be honest, it, it's, um, I don't like when it's thrown out there because I feel like the boxing, the casual boxing fan holds on to it and they start throwing the term around, you know, it's kind of like the term GOAT, right? All of a sudden, everyone's called the GOAT when they're a great basketball player or whatever, you know, sport they may be in. So let's not do the same with weight bully, right? Because it's you're going to see that it's going to become popular. And if two guys aren't identical in height, size, and all that, it's going to be thrown around. It's going to be used as an excuse. So let's clear something up. Make sure you share this video if you can. So what is a weight bully, right? Is a weight bully just a guy that's naturally bigger than the other and they happen to fight? Is a weight bully that fights another guy in a weight class that's smaller than him? Kind of like, you know, Jamel Canelo, Vasily Lomachenko fighting at 135 when he has no business there. Mikey moving up to fight Spence when he fought Spence. Uh, Canelo jumping up to 175 to fight Bavol. All those. Are those weight bullies? The answer is no. That is not what a weight bully is. When you sign up for a fight at a higher or a lower weight class, the person that you are fighting is not a weight bully towards you is not a weight bully. That's not what a weight bully is in boxing by definition. A weight bully in boxing is a bigger guy that's able to make weight and that's able to cut a substantial amount of weight in order to make weight at a lower weight class. One prime example of this is Chavez Jr. Chavez Jr. is a big, big, I mean, he's not a humongous dude, but the guy probably walks around at when he was fighting, he probably walked around at 190, 200 pounds. Somehow he was able to make weight at 160. That is what's considered a weight bully because he's just a big, big dude that is somehow able to make weight. So instead of fighting guys closer to his size, as we've seen when he fought from Farah, from Farah put a beating on him because he was finally matched up against someone his size. A weight bully has an advantage inside the ring where they're taking the shots of a lesser opponent because they're that much bigger naturally. But again, they're just able to make weight. So the opponent is like, it's 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 you're gonna it's gonna be hard to fight a dude like that because he's gonna rehydrate to a normal size, which is way bigger than you, right? Um, and I'm I'm not knocking him, okay? I'm not knocking him. Please don't take it that way. I, I, I this is I'm just trying to keep it consistent. David Benavidez is another one. I'm not gonna call him a weight bully, but the guy is a big dude and he's able to make weight. He's able to make weight at 168 when in reality, you guys see how drained he almost looks sick when he's fighting at 168. That's because he's naturally a lot bigger. <clears throat> if you want to go further back, Paul Williams. I'm not knocking Paul Williams. You know, he had an accident years and years back. I'm not knocking him, but Paul Williams was 6'2", 6'3", fighting at 147. And why is that? That was not his natural weight. He was just able to make weight so he campaigned at lower weight classes. There's been a few guys like this that are able to make weight. That is what's considered a weight bully. Not a guy moving up, not a guy moving down, but a guy that's naturally big, but he is able to cut the weight and fight at a way lower weight class. So just a quick pop in. I'm here at work, but I just wanted to share that with you guys. Anyhow, y'all, thanks again for the support of the channel. Drop a comment down below. Hit that like button. Thank you for the love, yo. Much love. God bless. Peace.